Okay, how's it going ladies and gents? We're back with a brand new microphone. So if it sounds any different, it probably comes down to that. It should sound the same because it's the exact same model, but I replaced it just because one of the ears was going, so, you know. Here is the new NU team. We have Saab Lefty's Jinx with Copycat. Very fun indeed. You can avoid stuff like Sucker Punch just by using that. And you can copy the occasional, you know, Shadow Ball signal beam in case it comes in handy. Rampardus with Life Orb. Now the theme of this team is massive offense because there's way too much stall in NU. And stall, though it is a tactic a lot of people like to play, I am not one of those people. I'm not a big fan of stall, so I'm bringing the most offensive stuff I can. Defensive core is pretty standard though. Torkoal plus Vile Plume. It has all the stuff you need, Rapid Spin, Stealth Rock, Aromatherapy, blah blah blah. And then my other two, these are pretty much glass cannons, but we have a Scarfed Frogadier, just for U-turning and strong water attacks. Those are pretty good stats for a stage 2 evolution, you gotta admit. Like I use, that's not far behind something like Simipaw, to be fair. And it gets a nice move pool, so. The last thing is going to be a physical Murkrow, which I have used a couple of times in Gen 5. Normally I'd run Mirror Move over Tailwind there, because it's quite cool to like sub and then copy back whatever move they went for. But, you know, I figured Tailwind is quite good when you have a Jinx and a Rampardus around, so hopefully that's going to do some big damage as well. Oh god, it's Stunfisk! Why is it so flat? <laughs> okay, so Jinx is going to do a lot of work. Not sure what to expect as lead. I guess Stunfisk or potentially Sandslash? Let's go with Frogadier. Lilligant. Excellent. Not going to bother trying to Ice Beam, just going to get out of there. Just a Mantine. Hmm. Kind of feel like going to Rampardus to be honest, but he may be quicker depending on his spread. Let's try this. Lefties are probably just standard defensive. Let's go ahead and sub up. Hey, I could copycat U-turn, but that seems completely pointless. Air slash. That would have broken the sub. That is unfortunate. Oh, by the way, I'm running Frost Breath because... One, it doesn't get freeze-dry. And two, it's quite good for stuff that tries to calm mind up. Like, I don't know, Mishana or... Slurp off, something like that. Ah, it's cool. And it makes a nice change. Uh oh! Who's this bitch? No. That's gonna do, yeah, pretty good damage. 53. Eh, I can happily go for another one. And whatever he brings in... Actually, to be fair, he has, what, five weak to ice? Which is brilliant. Oh yeah, for some reason, apparently Showdown's got some new, like, obscenity, profanity, whatever, filter built in. So, like, if you message someone the word, what is it that changes to poopy heads? I think the word faggot changes to poopy heads automatically, for whatever reason. So have some fun with that. Type random words and it will convert it. 
Why there's a correlation between faggot and poopy head, I have no idea. What are you gonna do? <laughs> Let me try... Vileplume walls it pretty well. Hmm. Yeah, I guess that's fine. No! I think the only real threat is the Dragonair. The rest of it Jinx can handle, if I weaken this a little bit. Look, watch this. Boom! The power of filters. Ellie, can you please refrain from using that kind of language? Unsub Ellie. This might still kill. Oh, maybe not. Oh my god! Yeah, to be honest, I can't see Vileplume being around in NU for much longer. Like, the rest of the team, I thought, yeah, let's have some fun, let's put in Frogadier and Trollkadan. But I had to put in a Vileplume and a Torkoal to have at least a solid core. Hey, Brian. Shut up. Oh, unfortunately I don't have a great switch in. I'm not going to go straight to Rampardos. So I may as well try and stay in and hit it. This is my special wall, so... No! What if Jinx is quicker? Huh, ah, turns out it is. Just hope he's not scarfed. Boom! Okay, he's gonna forfeit. Oh shit, a deli bird. Let's do this. Jinx is quite a good lead in most cases, to be honest. This can't kill me with anything. So let's go ahead and... Frost Breath. Yep, no problem. Then now be a good time to switch. Let's make the most obvious switch in the world and go to Vileplume. Literally the entire chat on the side is full of people saying meanie and poopy head. Jesus Christ, it's like being back in preschool. Let me see... I want to see if he's like Eviolite or choiced in some way. Because if he's Eviolite, he'll probably Volt Switch. Yes, power. Definitely not broken. Low JK. Is a taunt, whatever. Ah, 
How was that thing dial? What? <laughs> I don't know, man. Let's go to Torco. Goes for the forbidden move. Let's go for rocks. Power up punch. Oh, shit. That's actually pretty cool. Hmm. Well, it's not going to do shit to a Torco, but I don't want it setting up. Get the burn there. <laughs> Vile Plume. So I can do a bit more damage. I mean, like, Ordino has a horrible attack stat, but at least it's bulky and at least it can regenerate, you know? Boom! Ah, I should have gone for synthesis. What are you going to do? Fanta. Because Fanta's cold? I don't know, man. Okay, Aerial Ace, so it might be like Banded Hustle or something. Let's see. Don't be Vital Spirit. Ah, excellent. And that's a dead deli bud. What's my rank just out of interest? Okay, so it's not that low. I think the deli birds are gonna be disappearing pretty quick in a couple more games. <laughs> I just I should stop looking at the side chat. It's just basically Ellie and a couple of other people repeatedly saying poopy head and meanie. What is this? I don't even. Do not want to let you have a sub. Nope. If there's one thing you really don't want to give a sub, it's a cacturn. Look at that. Beast. Goes to the Electabuzz. That's fine. Fodder off Torkoal. Let's go to the Beast Rampados. Come on, Oko! I wonder if it can take one. You guys need to see the power of Rampados. I still have never actually come across it. it ah, it doesn't quite kill. But it's a stun fisk. But that thing, like, once you get set up, it will sweep most teams, unless there's something really bulky at full health like this. True story. Oh, I don't know. A couple of ice beams, that'll do it. At least he can't T-bolt me if I do. Boom. Now he probably has to go for, uh, what, Focus Blast or something? Ah, no! Ice-type bitches. GG.